The cartoon character Bugs Bunny always munched on carrots and said, What's up, Doc? Was Bugs Bunny trying to give us a message? Yes, he was. Rabbits naturally love carrots, and we should too. Wisdom passed down through generations has suggested that carrots are good for our eyesight. Recent studies have proven this to be true, since carrots are a great prevention against macular degeneration. Carrots are also a good prevention against diarrhoea, especially when mixed with beetroot and taken in a juice. These staple vegetables are full of beta-carotene, vitamin E and vitamin A, and are perfect for detoxifying the body. They're a good diuretic and help fight against fluid retention, indigestion, colic, digestive cramps and IBS, and they cleanse the kidneys and liver, helping to prevent kidney stones. Further benefits of carrots include helping with the symptoms of PMS and cystitis, slowing the growth of cancerous cells, assisting to combat asthma, and also helping with skin disorders, especially with dry and mature skin. On a spiritual level, carrots help bring a sense of inner peace and security, easing fragility and vulnerability. They are known to be therapeutic and relaxing as they calm an overactive and nervous mind, helping to combat emotional stress and bringing us a good night's sleep. Carrot seed essential oil is also good for calming, restoring and supporting us. The oil is made from steam distilling the seeds and mixing some in a carrier oil with a few drops of fennel and grapefruit makes a perfect massage for easing digestion. Alternatively, mixing with lemon and geranium essential oil makes a relaxing massage to ease PMS and relieve water retention. Carrots are extremely versatile as a food and are very reasonably priced. They can be eaten raw, cooked or juiced and are good in salads, as snacks and nibbles, with dips, in stews, in casseroles, and in fact in almost all types of dishes from all around the world. They add a touch of colour to the plate and pair well with peas, just like Forrest Gump and his Jenny.